Hey guys, it is Tara. I'm here with another box box. Um, I have had the chance to open it and actually use some of these products, but some of them I haven't yet. So I'm going to kind of do a talk through with you guys. And yeah. So the first thing that I noticed is this, uh, it's a, a face mask and it's, uh, it's by Boots, their botanics line, uh, iconic clay mask shine away. Okay. I did. I have tried this and it is fan freaking tastic. It is the strangest texture I've ever felt in my life. It's really liquidy at first, but then it kind of gets like almost like sand. I don't, I don't know how to explain it, but it's super runny, but super I really don't know how to explain it. It's the, the texture on it's a little strange for any like compared to any other face mask I've ever used. It's not like one of those clay mud masks that you use and it's just like the texture is not like super thick. It's kind of thin and runny at first and then like the little granules and it kind of grasp together if that makes any sort of sense. I've never had a mask like this before but it does t uh, mattify you and it really like like my skin felt so nice after I tried this one. So, um, this is the full size. I think it's ten dollars. Yeah, ten dollars. You can get boots at Target right now. Um, and mine, I just saw this and got one for one of my friends. So, um, I know that it's actually out and available. This is a John John Frieda three day straight flat iron spray. I don't have the spray version. I have the serum version. I really like it uh, for when I do straighten my hair and actually like when it's super smooth and it does last for three days for me at least it does so um yeah i haven't tried this yet but i'm sure it's gonna be awesome the next thing is some tea from red rose they sent us two flavors uh lemon chiffon and then cream caramel honestly guys i'm not a hot tea person at all i don't like it not a fan um I did try the caramel one. It was pretty good for being hot tea, for me not liking hot teas. I'm, I want to try the lemon one. I haven't yet, but I have, have high hopes for this because tea and lemon go really well together. So um, I might try that tonight and let you guys know how that is. They also have been coupons for tea, which is cool. But I can't, I haven't found this brand here. I keep keeping it like, I keep looking for it just because. It's always fun when they send me a coupon and if I can give it to somebody else who I know will use it, but I haven't seen it here yet. So maybe it's one of those new brands or something that they don't carry at my Target, which is where I usually grocery shop. The next thing they sent me is some eyelashes. These are ooh, by Kiss and it says, look so natural. They're tapered ended so they look more like your natural lashes. So that's cool. Um... Obviously, I haven't tried these yet either, but they look much more natural than most lashes that I've seen at the store, so that's awesome. They're thicker on the outside and then taper off on the inside, like the inner corners of your eyes, so I feel like that would be really, really nice. Really pretty. And the last thing, which I thought was so funny, is this is dry bag of cookies. This is like the Valentine's Day box, but I didn't get it till like way after Valentine's Day and I haven't had a chance to sit down and actually like go through most of it until now. I love box boxes. They're so fun to me. Um, if you guys aren't familiar with Influencer, they sent me this box for free to try out the products and then I go on to their website after I've tried them all and let them know how I uh, like them and what my thoughts were. And um, yeah, there's all kinds of different surveys you can do to qualify to get boxes and it's a blast, so uh, completely free, and so that's always nice to get free stuff to try out for, for, you know, for fun. Like, who doesn't want a face mask and some hair straightening stuff and some lashes and some tea and some freaking Hershey's Kisses? That is a giant bag of Hershey's Kisses. Um, so yeah, if you guys are interested in doing uh, Influencer, I'll leave the link down below. You don't have to have a referral or anything, uh, but if you guys do want to sign up, I can send you the email. Um, I'll leave my email address down in the description like it always is. Alright guys, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you soon.